Hi, I'm Jake, and welcome to the newest podcast on YouTube called Jake's Happy Nostalgia Show, where I interview people involved with kids' shows and more from our childhoods. We'll be sharing our favorite memories, talk behind the scenes moments, and so much more. I'm your host, Jake Devonball, and welcome to this Happy Nostalgia Show episode. Hello! Welcome to another episode of Jake's Heavy Nostalgia Show. I'm your host, of course, always, you know, name that's on the, you know, of course, the podcast, you know, Jake, of course. Anyways, we have some, some amazing episode, you know, for the second episode. Also, I'm going to say this before we're, um, before we're, I'm seeing the co-hosts, you know, for this episode, I'm going to say this. Thank you all so much for the support all we, are, we already have so far, especially the first episode. Um, but thank you so much for having us. You know, like, to be honest, the first episode we had, like, Bruce Lynn Oil, oh, my gosh, what an amazing person for having, the, especially for starting it, which I'm thinking probably both, which both, both of you, that, that's part of the first episode, we're, like, we definitely agree with me for sure. Anyways, um, but anyways, another great episode for when we're about to have. Anyways, we have some co-hosts that, that you probably know from the first episode, named Chris Bixby and Matthew Johnson, how both, how both of you guys are. Very good. good. That's awesome. Wait, what, what you guys think? Of, what you guys think of the star of the first episode? Really, it was really good. It was, it was really good, except you really couldn't fun. hear me. So yeah, but, but, but now we can. But hey, your, your voice now. is actually here for this. Yes, especially. My oh my gosh. Here. Well, of course. Thank goodness that the first episode though is just, it's just the first episode. You know, it's, it's yeah. work in progress for what uh, for better. You know, especially Streamyard. Oh my gosh, Streamyard is just Streamyard is just like so glitchy. I know. Yes. I know. Honestly, this this is working pretty good so far. So yes, yes, yeah. Because Zoom is probably amazing with what, of course, the quality and the how our voices are having. It's uh, what we we experience the stream yard. So, but anyways, um, so anyways, what we what we have for this podcast at the moment, I, I think to be honest, really mostly for this podcast, to be honest, at this at this at this stage, not just one, not just two. But three co-hosts is in this pod in, 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 for this podcast, and one of them is going to make his first appearance. And 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 one is both is a, one of our good friends is, and he's a, he's a, and I think it's a big I think it makes sense for this is the first episode. You know, it's kind of like boring related like podcast episode anyway. You know, but anyways, and you know, he's a, he's a boring fan, of course. You know, and good friends of good, we're good friends of his, and his name is Y McCullough. How are you, Wyatt? Doing good. That's awesome. I'm hyped. I know. Me too. Like, like yes. you're just amazing. Just like what? <laughs> I know you're excited, especially you know what. I'm what, extremely what, hyped. Like what? What are you? What, what were we just talking about? Where we just got started? Yeah, anyway, anyway. So, like I said, this is it's another great guest where we're gonna have. Yeah. Anyway, so I have nothing else to say, but he. What we're gonna have for the guest is one. He was Barney for Barney's Barney's big surprise. Two, Barney in it's time for counting video. Three. Oh yeah, and also of course he was he was Barney for like a, for like for like understudy reasons because it, it mostly I'm thinking he was Barney for just for that video and the last episodes of the one season i think it's either four or five or six i think it was i think it was four i think that's time yeah. when david and bob right. were it was david and bob were were, were, were production for the before, adventure I movie yep. yeah and and i'm think and he at this point i think he's now involved with dragon ball i think that that if to the people who knows dragon ball i think that's a good episode for you to watch right there to be yeah. honest and i think it was why it told me that he was actually a, probably a part of Bob the Builder Live. That he was, yeah. It was pretty- mentioned in a Purple Roads episode. Oh yeah, I, I, to, yes. to be honest, I remember one point. I remember, I remember one point of like during the the first episode of Purple Roads, which carries us, you know, podcasts to have after Purple Tales. He mm-hmm. was Jeff Ayers, you know, who you know, of course he's Baby Bob. He was he he mentioned the first episode with Bob and you know, of course Carrie. Mm-hmm. Like, like he said something that the scene where we can't, well, we're about to, we're going to explain about what he said later on because 
because I think it's best for Dawn when we're going, when we're talking about that, then I can say what you said on that yeah. point. And this Anyways. is one of, that, JG, sorry to interrupt. That is one of his favorite stories, apparently, for the people on YouTube to tell oh, about wow. what happened. Well, we'll get into it a bit later, though. Yeah, we'll get, I'm done. Totally yeah. Done. Anyways, um, <laughs> you name it. He did all of those. And oh, yeah, he also, not that I realized, he also did, he, he was with Carrie that he also did the hospital visits, I think, with, with Carrie, I think. So both of them do, you know, barring for, you know, for the hospital visits. And I know it's very touchy feeling of what, if you like, what the, what the child is going through. And for seeing, like, like, literally internal to the sadness to, like, a happy room. Because mm-hmm. I, I, I my, because what I'm saying just for now, it reminds me of the, of the, of Carrie's Purple Tales episode. Oh my gosh, what an emotional roller coaster that he had while he was saying some stuff on there. I think, I think he probably, I think Chris would agree with me on that. Cause I remember you probably yes. watched that episode too, but I'm thinking. Yeah. But anyways, for after all the stuff he did, and, and he's here. He's, he's Josh Martin. How are you, Josh? I'm well, thank you. Um, How are you? I, I'm, I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. And thanks for, for being here. Really. Yeah. Yeah. And, and Thank you all for having me. You're welcome. welcome. You're the first Marty person. Yep. Yeah. First mm-hmm. Marty person we've had. Second person in all. Yep. Yeah. yeah. For the sec for the second, you know. And you know, you know quite an honor. Uh, Thank you. You're, you're welcome. Just you're welcome. welcome, man. Just. <laughs> but anyway, before I get to the questions, um, I was going to say that. So you guys got some questions for me. Jakey does. Yes, Jakey does. Jakey's got questions. Well, well, some of them too. All right. Anyway. Um, so, I forgot to say this, but this podcast is actually now back on streaming. Uh, 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 no, not back on streaming. The podcast is now streaming now on he, which is he, he, oh there, there he is wait wait do you say something josh because I, I was talking yeah, no we, we, he asked no, me you for you froze for us you froze for us oh yeah. that, oh that's weird anyway, JP, that's he's weird. Ready. just in case it happens in the future so like this then that's that happens like that but anyways yeah. and lastly Technology. i'm going to say this before we get into the main part main part of this you know why we're doing this anyway this podcast is it's available now on Spotify and Spotify Mixcloud. And what's the and other Mix, app? Mixcloud. So, yes. and YouTube. So, yes. Well, yeah, yeah, definitely on YouTube. Are, yeah. Are, if you, you, got, yeah, if you guys have any things. contact, you know, for, for this, you know, podcast, you know, check the description. And, and if you want for like for hours, you can like check it for hours as well. Mm-hmm. But anyways, I'm not, I'm, I think that's nothing I'm saying, but until the first question that we're going to have for for this but anyways um okay there we go yeah all right we're back technology (laughs) great with the we're back (laughs) yeah we're back we're back we're back at that so yeah (laughs) yeah go for it yep anyways the first question that i think is best for you know for start what did, what happened that that you think about starting a career for like being a bar actor for, you know, for Barney and you think about doing stuff for you know Dragon Ball? What what does it start for you? You know, doing a career and you know being Barney and you know for you know and Dragon Ball and what what how does it start and for for you now? Sure, all those for you know. Right. Well, I uh, I moved to Dallas, Texas from Louisiana in 1994 with the intention to uh, become an actor. Uh, I uh, enrolled in an acting school called KD Studio. And um, I went to school there for a couple of years. I met some friends um, and we started comedy troops. And then when I graduated, my first audition was for the big purple one for uh, Barney's Big Surprise. And uh, so, Boom. Uh, you know, four weeks later, I booked the part and about five months later, I was on the road jumping around uh, the country in the world uh, in a big purple dinosaur costume. 
So uh, that was pretty cool. And, uh, you know, after after three years on the road and doing the, the TV show for a summer and special events and everything like that, I, uh, I took a break and I came off the road and mm -hmm. uh, and got back with my boys in the comedy troupe. And um, a couple of the guys, uh, Chris Rager, oops, sorry, uh, Chris Rager and Mike McFarland. Uh, AKA Mr. Satan and Master Roshi, respectively, in Dragon Ball Z. Uh, they they booked parts on the show before I did, and they brought Chris Sabat, AKA Vegeta, Piccolo, um, you know, just about every other part on Dragon Ball Z, and uh, and they they brought him he invited him to a show and they saw he saw me do a character in the show called the pillsbury homeboy uh as a gangster rapping pillsbury doughboy and uh and chris sabbath saw uh, he saw me do that and heard me do that and he was, came up to me after the show and he said uh i think i found the boys of majin Boo." <laughs> and uh i was like okay and so, uh, yeah, he called me into the studio and he showed me, showed me this anime and uh, told me the story about this big pink guy and told me he was just, uh, he was misunderstood. He was just a big baby. He just wanted to eat some candy, <laughs> eat candy and chocolate. Um, but he also uh, ate people and destroyed <laughs> towns and people. <laughs> and things and so i was like oh okay now i see why you got the pillsbury homeboy so um yeah that was that was it and um and i've been doing it for 21 years now wow wow yeah that's yeah it's crazy it's, uh, i'm not trying to be off topic that's the same exact like how long time it went greg murray and jeff were, mm -hmm. were, were wiggles you know, yeah we are we are big wiggles fans yeah right yeah. on we're definitely mm -hmm. we're, we're, we're <laughs> love them love those guys oh wow that's that, that's cool that, that's cool that you know the wiggles that's that's awesome because I, I know because i know the wiggles were actually were there for the um for the, oh, for, the for intermission act for for musical castle which, yes yes which i think I, probably I, wiggles are, are starting to gain popular because from, from that concert yeah, around that time they were getting popular in america i think yeah, they jumped off. The first, they jumped off the from that. One. I hmm. mean, you go from you go from intermission <laughs> at a Barney show to yeah. your own tour. You're doing something right, yeah. Yeah, yeah. to to to, to, to experience for to, until the second act of that of that tour. Right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's what that that musical back musical castle is actually a really really cool really cool concert for. They did a great job with all the shows, yeah. yeah me and Matthew actually all, both, all, you know, other Barney. Me and Matthew actually both come. saw a Barney tour, but it was a different. Tour. I've I've been. It wasn't the one you were in. It was Colorful World. Yeah, Colorful that World. World. That was a good one mm -hmm. as well. Yeah, I've seen Birthday Bash, which but, Antoine Steele did. The Barney Birthday Bash is a lesser known one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Did anyone see Bob the Builder live? I told yes. you. you did I didn't see Bob the Builder live. I actually own it on DVD. Oh, right on. Yep. Uh, well, I don't think I wasn't in. I'm not in that one. Uh, that was. I think it was recorded in uh, in Europe someplace in the UK, probably. Um, uh, yeah, I just I jumped on in the the last four months of the US tour. Uh, driving you, Scoop. What are you doing now? Oh, oh, oh Scoop. That's 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 cool. Even yes, we can. <laughs> that's awesome. That's awesome. That, that's awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. We can still do it after, after I don't even know how long even that even. Oh, that was even, 03. Even It was two thousand three. Oh wow! Wow. Uh, Eighteen years. Wow. Yeah. This is old. Yeah, I was barely into. I was barely into Dragon Ball Z at that point. <laughs> You're like you're on you're on the mode to the, to the scoop. <laughs> yep. All right. But anyways, anyways, what what a great story you know that you have you know for yep. for, for for you know what people think about you know for you being in there and then just, you know for for more like for Dragon Ball and Bob the Builder that's 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 awesome. Uh, anyways, um, 
Anyway, the next question, why it's, I'm going to, I, I don't, I know you the question. You want me to ask it? For this. So, so take the fall on that question. What is, it. okay. We've heard it from Purple Rose. We've heard it from people. What is the story with the fire on the bar? Is that like, how did this happen? Because you know more than we do. Well, yeah. So yeah, because he was in the suit. <laughs> yeah. Yes, he right. was in the suit on that part. So I yeah. Sure, go on. What do you remember? That I remember that where, according to the okay, so I can see it now. So we're going to about it, that Jeff Ayers were, of course, he, he was paid on, on, of course, you know, for, huh? for probably so long that you know he was a, he was he remembered that part. That I remember that during the one episode, the, the popcorn scene, where mm-hmm. and then after after the popcorn, whatever he he rem- he remembers like the, the smoke or the smell, whatever. He thought it was a smoke. Oh, and then after they take, after doing that take again, they they realized it was a, it was fire inside or something. I, I I think it's because of the wire that's something that was like what happened. I don't think it, it was good. Fire or something yeah, and Jakey didn't know about the fire until I told him about it. I believe right. the episode was good. Yep. Couldn't find. Yeah, I, I ha- yeah the wiki confirms it. I know. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yes. But anyway, anyway, take a follow from that. Um, yeah. <laughs> That was it. That, that's all. That's exactly what it was. I, uh, we were, we didn't, as far as I know, there wasn't any video on it because uh, we weren't, we, we weren't recording. We were what they call prepping to roll. Uh, and because you used, uh, they used video back then, it wasn't digital. So if you recorded it, it was done. Right, you had to keep going, keep going, keep going. You didn't get to go back and do it over, or, or just keep adding, adding, adding. You would eventually run out of tape. So, mm-hmm. uh, um, yeah, we were we were just record, we were just rehearsing, and uh, because we were rehearsing, I turned my fans on um, because I couldn't have them on while we recorded because the kids' microphones would pick up the fan sounds. So, uh, you know. Uh, which to that point, there's no video, unfortunately. I'd love mm-hmm. some. But yeah, I uh, turned the fan on and I was just standing there. And then I had to make a move around uh, Scooter's table. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And as soon as I took a step, I was like, what? Are... Some smells like smoke. And I was looking around. I didn't see anybody making any moves or anything, so. I just went on and a couple of seconds later, I took another step and I smell more smoke. And I was like, ooh, that is strong. And then I had to go all the way around Scooter's table. <coughs> Pardon me. You're fine. And it's fine. I'm, I'm having flashbacks, guys. <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> there you go. There you go. Uh, so uh, yeah, I took it, walking around the Scooter's table, every breath I was taking was, was smoke and I couldn't breathe. And so, Nobody was moving or anything, so I ran off. I ran off the set, yelling, "Get me out of this thing!" Did anyone else, like any of the kids, know what was happening? Yeah. No, no. You know, they're really, really protective of the kids in all ways. You know, just you know, taking care of them, mm. making sure they're uh, you're not not working too much, getting you know, getting snacks, all the right stuff you're supposed to do. But at that point, you know, they just they. I think they. I think the kids crowded around me. I don't remember a hundred percent, but, and, and then I think they took them off and uh, explained everything was cool, but I had a break for the rest of the day. <laughs> Go yeah. figure. After a and, uh, the curiosity of what, which is what's going on during that point. So. Yes. Yes. That's the deal. So um, yeah, you know, went to the hospital. They checked me out for smoke inhalation and uh, wasn't a problem. Mm-hmm. Wasn't a problem. I was back good. to work the next week. That, that, that's good. That's good. They're, they're okay yeah. on that point. So. Oh, yeah. They took care of me always. Always. They probably pampered me a little bit too much. I probably could have gotten back to work that day, but they wouldn't let me. So, you know, <laughs> I took the day off. There you go. There you go. That's, you know, you know, breaks, you know. But sometimes, you know, the show is going the show has to go on sometimes when where what depends on what, you know. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah, no. well, coming from the road, coming from the road, there would have been no, hey, take the day off, come back next week, and we'll, you know, get better. Uh-uh. 
Show is going. The curtains yeah. opened. Show must go on. Action. Yeah. The show must go yeah. on. Yeah. All right. That's right. One way or the, the other. understudy. I'm sorry. That's what I've heard from that. And Carrie was the main for that. Wait, are you talking about yeah. being surprised? Yeah, because he we was the one in the switched. car. You were, I thought he was the one in the car. Were you the main one or were you? Carrie was for the, the main video, one. The one the for the car. video, for the video, I'm in the car, the balloon, yep. and old McDonald. Ah. That's him. Wow. But on tour, we would switch those parts every other show so that mm -hmm. we would have a break. You know what I mean? One part is longer than the other one, right? Three songs right. versus. Yeah. Yeah. You know, what's that? Five, set, 10 to 15 minutes versus an hour and 15 minutes. You know what I mean? So yeah. we'd yeah. switch. And then the person who didn't do, the person who had the, uh, the, sh the number two part, they called it, uh, the, the car, the, balloon and the farmer song uh we do the hospital visit that day oh. mm -hmm. so uh you know so we wouldn't be, it's a long it's a long deal we'd usually do uh, tv that morning at about 5 30 a.m and then go to the hospital at 10 o'clock do a sing-along do a 45 minute sing-along in the lobby and then go room to room after that to all the kids who couldn't come down and then after that, it'd be about lunchtime. <laughs> and then, uh, and then we uh, quick, quick nap. And then at the, uh, back to the gig, probably about four o'clock for any special meet and greets and then dinner at five and then show at seven. So if you did the, if you did the uh, meet and greet and all that PR that day, uh, getting on stage for another hour and 15, wasn't the, wasn't the first thing you wanted to do. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, uh, so yeah. So I have you, a question. So, oh. um, was there any time during the tour? Because the audio was, the voices were pre-recorded, right? Yeah. Yeah. Was there any a point like in at any show where the where the audio wasn't working and y'all and y'all had to like cancel or something? No, if you can believe it, not once. Not on my. Not on the big surprise. Not on big surprise. I. You'd have to ask the boys. Uh. Carrie and maybe McAllister, um, if they had any any instances like that. But yeah, oh, David Franks went out went out with us the first year for that for that very purpose for emergencies in case something happened to that. It was a and digital audio voice. Yeah, yeah. And oh, he would just David say, Franks is, David Franks right? is only real fortune did the voice. Oh, yeah, true. And he would uh, he in case something happened, he would just. His whole job was just to come on and say, um, Barney and friends will be right back. Oh, or, you know what I mean? Yeah. Something like that. He wouldn't, he wouldn't go on and ad lib yeah. the whole rest of the show. It was just, uh -huh. he would make a quick announcement. And that was it. I mean, what a gig, right? Yeah. yeah. I, I, yeah. I, didn't know you, I didn't know you can make the Barney voice anyway, by the way. <laughs> uh, thank, yeah. Well, you know, after being, being inside that costume, I've been blessed with a little bit of a, a decent ear. So, yeah, I've yeah. just I character too. Like Bob was and all them. Right, and Bob, Bob's my man. Uh, love Dean Wynn as well. Um, but yeah, I used to sit in the, I, I do all three of the dinos. I used to, <laughs> I used, you know, I, I can do the whole show. I remember it. I can't um, as well. Um, yeah. baby Bob, what's <laughs> wrong? Why are you crying? Um, BJ won't share the cookies. <laughs> wow. Is he? I bought them. <laughs> 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 Remember, it's better to share. <laughs> no, there it is. Yeah. There you go. There, you go. Mm -hmm. there we are. Yeah. Sharing is caring. <laughs> <laughs> so you uh, you mentioned earlier about um hospital visits what was that what was that like for you and carrie doing like all the hospital visits yeah uh, you know it was uh rewarding and draining at the same time right so wearing a big big heavy hot costume and working and dancing and then uh you know add to that all the emotion and yeah. and drama yeah. that goes along with the hospitals right Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so um yeah yeah it was it, it was all that 
it was rewarding and draining at the same time. But very, but you know, the rewards outweigh out, outweigh any any kind of physical, emotional draining that I have because you know, at the end of the day, I got to leave. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. what the people what you they just thought about like the people the children. Fortunately, just, yeah. Um, yeah, you know. You just want to they just want to like yeah, how, you how guys touching that was. Yeah. You know, you know, it's Barney. The Barney's real. Mm -hmm. You know, that's, them, yeah. that's, that's real as it gets. Yeah, you know, the voice wasn't there with you. Oh yeah, right. Yeah, or, well, or true. he's always doing voice rests for the show that night. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah, there you go, right there. Yeah. Yeah. That's so how that's, we did that. Oh, that's that, that's amazing. But before we get to to next question, I'm gonna say I am so that I don't know. I remember we talked about like the um. Barney's big surprise that the, the voices were, were pre-recorded that you mentioned, Matthew, that mm -hmm. I, I know Barney Live in New York City were, were recorded live. Was live, yeah, that was, I believe the only Yeah, live they were under the stage, yeah. And I have another question, because I'm surprised, I don't think Jakey brought this up, because nobody mentions this. Do you have any memories with Tommy DePaula? Because we lost him last year. Just upsetting. You know what? I did, I did that show. Yeah. I did that That's show with him. him. He was really cool. It was super nice, great guy. It was a fun episode. I got to do it with the uh, with the worm, the bookworm. Yeah. It's only oh yeah, uh, Booker T. Yeah, yeah, oh, Booker T. Yeah, yeah. Oh my T. god, I kind of sucks. <laughs> I, it, it, I think he only appeared just just, just for on um, that season. That I remember yeah. what it did. When yeah, did yeah. yeah. That's the one I remember. Yeah, you, know, you got to work with him on time for counting. As well. There was another episode besides his time for counting. He was, I believe, also in. Booker T was also in book books are fun. Yeah. I want to say books so. are fun. Books yeah. are great. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. okay. So, it's actually good. It's actually a good song. It's, it's a good song. Good song. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They're all great. Aren't they? Right. Yeah. They really yeah, are. Head after, you know, yeah. It's kind of. Hey, it's kind listen. Of anytime, 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 anytime anybody tells me I hate that song, I've heard that so many times. I'm like, you haven't heard it as many times as I have. I can't. <laughs> Okay. And you can still enjoy it. So that's really, that's, yeah, really, really, that's, sure. really, that's really when like you're that. 21 years old and you wake up singing, I love you. you <laughs> oh gosh. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> you know you've heard it a few times. Yeah, that's how mm -hmm. much you love that song. You that yes. What's the point? Very what's catchy. Point? It is very, oh, very easy, it. very easy to get stuck in your head, too. Yeah, it is. Yeah. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. But they really are. They're all just wonderful. That's songs. just a pattern with kids with kids yeah, with know, entertainment party, like, kids entertainment songs. songs. They're just a bunch of kids entertainment songs are just really catchy. I don't know why. Yeah. Because but... so probably like, how, how more how more we're buying yes, and so more the songs you thinking. You know that and much more that that you just, how more you get stuck in your head. That really is all and of them. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, very true indeed. So that that's a whole nother show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We're bringing you back out there, you go. Yeah. <laughs> right? Bring you and carry on. Because <laughs> just carry's actually yeah. a thing here. Dude, well hook I'll I'll give you a good reference. Hey, you get him. Oh yeah, yeah. Carrie <laughs> mentioned Carrie mentioned Jakey on and Life on the Purple Roads and uh Yeah. Really. Uh, yeah. Watch it now. Uh oh, somebody getting some getting some rub over there. Good work. <laughs> there you go. Oh my gosh. Anyways, I remember Jake, that. Dude. Sorry, why? Jake, you flip out. We got him on. Yeah. I would too, because he did New York. I think we all would, to be honest. Yeah, mm -hmm. you know, it's Carrie Stinson. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You get Dean on, nobody has him. Uh, oh, right. yeah. But it, it depends, you know, what's going to yeah. happen. But anyway, so I, I'm glad, you know, during the time where there's a fire where the, they, they take the caution off, I, I'm glad that the, the the cast of the stab that just that really like i'm glad most of the buying cast is just really touch what is going on because you know it's you know it's you know it's boring it's like literally it's not a job i feel like it's not i feel like working part it's not a job it's just a family like like what the show was for so many years that's that, what you're right you're right that's what uh, added to its longevity yeah yeah mm -hmm. it was it was not as there was definitely work to be done 
there were definitely jobs that had to be filled, um, but it was done from the, you know, from the mindset and the heart, uh, you know, that kids were, kids were first and you take care of them and mm-hmm. all that, all that stuff you're supposed to do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, so next question that I'm going, I'm going to give is that, what was your experience by doing the, the blue jay puppet team for coming over to Barney's house video and as well as for being the poor bit for Riff's musical zoo, if that was... If that was why if I'm like right or not. Because I know you I know you did something that I know you did something for Brian, not not just not just season yeah. not just season four yeah. six era. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. I did the blue jay. And yeah, uh and I blues. did the polar bear. Yeah. I was an elephant at one point. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. So uh yeah, I I did uh Yep, that's oh, and uh I didn't, it never aired. It uh, they actually redid it digitally. Let's see, was this back in oh oh two maybe maybe oh two oh one? And uh, I got cast as a mouse, a surfing mouse. Oh, oh I know what you're talking oh. about. Oh my right. god! You're talking right. about Murray. Murray. Yeah, yeah Murray. Murray. Yeah, that's right. Murray. Yeah, dude. And I auditioned and I got it like this. And I was like, Murray, the mouse. Hey, all right. <laughs> no, dude. <laughs> and so I went in. No, your like that. What'd you say? And uh, and they they put makeup on me and gave me a costume and everything. And I shot it. They changed it. Did they change the voice too? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't do that. Wow. At least I don't wow. think I did. I should go back Sam and watch Williams that. Did it. Huh? It says Sam Williamson did it on the wiki. Yeah. Well, then there it is. Yeah, it must be Sam Williamson. It was originally planned to be a live action mouse. Yes, yes. They, uh, or at least, you know, that's that's what I did. I don't know. Maybe <laughs> they didn't plan to do it at all. They just gave me some work, but I doubt that. Happened. They just wanted to put you in a mouse costume. <laughs> yeah, they're yeah. trolling me. Y'all. Just for the fun they're of it. They're trolling me back in 02. Can you believe that? <laughs> they release it. Dude, come on, kids. Everybody, let's find that footage. Just like Dancing in the Isles. Yes, oh Dancing God. in the Isles is something. Do you know the D- oh, okay? Do you know that exists? What is Dancing in the Isles? All right, so it is something that happened with the Wiggles and Barney. And it's separate from a musical castle. It is a show they did together, I believe, right, Chris? Yeah, I th- I think so. I remember seeing like a picture of like the poster. I think it was something that they did for uh, Walmart. I want to say, yeah, Walmart. Yeah. Like something they would have like on the little TVs at Walmart or something. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Does that ring the bells like Dancing in the Aisles? I didn't do that. That might, that might have been Carrie. We'll get him on to ask. Yeah. I feel like something like that probably would have been Carrie. Or I'll have David. Either one. Yeah. 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 But, can I, but I can understand why. Why the wiggle so like not I feel like a part of that which is gonna happen, but I feel like it's not happening because the Wiggles was so busy or something at the point on for, for touring at that at that point, I think. Or that's what I remember that's what I remembered why why Disney now is what why it wasn't a thing at the at last minute. I'll go but, with you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And we know the let's go tours in the archive somewhere. Did was he a part of were you a part of that? No, that was Carrie. Actually, no, that wasn't Kerry. That was Rick. What is it? The Let's Go Tour. The Let's Go Tour. That was Rick Stark, brother. For the Let's Go Tour. It was 2013. What was that? Was that the 20 year? That bus might tour? have been it. Maybe. The 20 year bus tour was me. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Was it? That was definitely me. Oh. That was. That was awesome. Just was it called right Let's now. Go? I don't know if it was called Let's Go. I just it was like at all the toy. I went to all the Toys R Us's in the country. Oh, wow! In a converted uh, charter bus. That wouldn't have been the Let's Go tour. The yeah, yeah, tour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big tour. Toy Factory and some other. It was like a big production oh. tour, kind of like Big Surprise or or. Um... Oh yeah! No, 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 no. This was a. <coughs> Pardon me. <clears throat> Backdrop in a photo op at Toys R Us. Come buy some mm-hmm. toys, kids, and take a picture with Barney. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
what, what good what good voice for that for that narration for like for, for that type of the way from that oh yeah i know which one you're talking about he's talking about oh. the big purple bus board yeah that that's there it. You oh, go. Man. wow there you go good man see i don't have to do any research i don't have to remember anything yeah you, guys you just look it up on the wiki you just look it up on the wiki it's on there yeah i can confirm it for you yeah how about that <laughs> i'm a reliable source there you go. Yeah. And anyway, so, so it was next. So next question I'm gonna say is that what is your what's your favorite app? What's your favorite V? Well, well, only V that probably 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 was only something for cutting. But what is your favorite like video slash episode that you do? Uh, we were part of like for funny friends. I want to say. It. Wow, favorite. Uh, man, you know I don't I don't know that I have a favorite per se um i i guess uh, there was one we were on uh the farm yeah, with that yeah 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 that's probably yeah. what it was yeah yeah that was fun got to play with the got to have some live animals what do they say yeah. never work with animals or children was it, it hard? so hard wasn't so bad um, i had a great take i had a great take uh where uh the sheep was supposed to already be into the barn before, and I was supposed to follow him all in and he and he hadn't gone the the song was over and I was standing right there with him and so I gave him a little beep beep <laughs> on the tail and he scooted uh, off dude, and that, I wonder right? if they have oh, that that's they, the take that's the take right I wonder if they, they have that because they really did, the did they use that in the in the episode or no no it's not on the episode no 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 would have been cool if they did yeah. yeah, they probably have that because they somebody released Barney Bloopers. Oh, yeah, someone did release. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. someone uploaded the Barney Bloopers, which is actually, it's actually hilarious that I'm glad that they have some episodes that actually caught on camera. It, it was probably, yeah. especially, the, especially the perch snatching one. Oh, my gosh. I'm, yeah. I'm also surprised you didn't say it's time for Count because of Phyllis Cicero. Oh, oh, come on, y'all. Mm. Phyllis, that's my girl. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I always oh. love working with Phyllis. Yeah, you know. All, all I'm gonna say about Phil, I'm gonna, I, what I'm gonna say about Phyllis, like literally, I'm so glad that that she was a part of P Purple Worlds episode before. Mm -hmm. You know. You know. Yeah. Yeah. What? Me too. What a member of what a memorable episode that like, probably last questions that probably someone will take about regards to Barney. Probably that's carry right there to to her to that episode. She's a great and person. I'm glad she's a part of it before. You know, but but yeah, that's, you what, that's where all. your life goes. Unfortunately, yeah. Whew. But I know I know the kids are really have a great time with with Phyllis for sure. Because I know, because I, I remember I remember one point during her episode. Um, while she while she was going to be here for the episode, whatever, the kids were so excited to, to be with her, and that, that's how that's how a good person she was. That right. Oh, be like Phyllis. Yes. Yeah, like uh, Tasha. Oh man. Oh man. That's... Yeah. Oh. All the ones that I was involved in, I loved. Hmm. Yeah, it's a blessing. Know, yeah, because you know it's privilege. It's every Barney thing. You know, you'd be blessed with everything and that's guards with it. No matter what it, ain't, what it is anyway. Right. Yeah. Oh. Anyway, so next question I'm gonna say is that. Is there like throughout your career as as Barney, the Dragon Ball, Bob the Builder, you name it? Um, is there like a easiest and hardest thing that you ever like that experience that you've been have throughout? Mm. Uh, man, the, man, the hardest. Ah, that's you got me stumped. I don't, I don't let things be too hard. You know what I mean? I like to take, and, uh, and not that say that I like to take the easy route, but you know what I mean? I like yeah. to, uh, I like to, I like to flow with things. I, I don't like to, I don't like obstacles. Mm -hmm. I navigate them, you know, not that anybody loves obstacles, but, uh, right. you know, mm -hmm. I, yeah. when I, when I meet an obstacle, I, I, I navigate under around over through i don't just uh you know i don't always 
just put my head down and, and go forward. Sometimes you got to. Sometimes you got no choice. Mm-hmm. And that's yeah. the secret yeah. of life. Some, the sometimes balance. you're alive. Right. You, you have to, to do something that they, they, they never tried. Like you have to like, try yeah. it or something. Yeah, sometimes you just got to work your way through it. Lots of people snickered when I told them I was moving to Dallas to become an actor. Lots yeah. of people from Louisiana yeah. gave a little snicker and thought, oh, that's cute. And Barney's and, based in Dallas. And so, you know, I definitely wouldn't have succeeded had I stayed in Louisiana, right? <laughs> so there you go. You, you know. miss 100% of the opportunities that you do not take. Hmm. That is true. That is very yeah. true. Yeah. So as long as you uh, use your noggin and, uh, and, and you pursue things with the right mindset and the right heart, then at the very least, you are going to progress. You may not achieve what it is that you, nec- that you initially set out to achieve, you, uh, but that may also be because uh, your goals change. And that's another thing, be, be flexible to adapt those goals to, to uh, new findings, uh, new learnings, uh, new obstacles. Uh, you know what I mean? So yeah. I, I, like to, I like to consider the word no to mean reapproach. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Right? No, no, I can say no. You can say no. But that yeah, doesn't mean the end. Yes. So. Doesn't mean that's all there is to it. And there's no more discussion. I mean, maybe, maybe for you, <laughs> maybe for them, but for me, that just means reapproach, reapproach the situation, especially if I want it or if I know. And initially, I'm. It's something that I've already thought about, and I know that it's worthy of my. Uh, of my attention and my uh, effort. So yeah. when I hear no, it's just like, oh, really? Okay. <laughs> All right. I'll be over here figuring out how to do it anyway. <laughs> you may think you stalk me or turn me down or whatever, you know what I mean? Or, or whatever mm-hmm. the case may be, but I just went back to the house, started plotting my new scheme. <laughs> yep. there you go. So yeah. There it is. Yep. To be honest, I think the way you part of the, the Barney's Big Surprise, where cause I, remember, cause I remember the, the old McDonald one like, so well, where, where you're playing the, yeah. the violin or something. Or, or yeah. what the heck Jake and I actually did a cover album to that. Yeah. Really? I did Barney cover albums. Jake and Wyatt did a cover album of Big Surprise. And I got a Who question. Did? Speaking of Big Surprise, Jake and Wyatt. Wyatt. Like, huh? Oh. Cool. Speaking of big surprise, what was it like working with Barry Pearl? I came from Fresh Tinker Club. That's my partner, Mr. Pearl. Yeah, it kind of, it kind of, it kind of sucks in a way where he he was only a part of the um, the well, uh, Magic Island, which Indeed. I think is part of the most one most nostalgic up one of the most nostalgic videos. Yeah, and, 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 I'm sorry for you guys, surprise. but that's but that's just the way it guys, goes. But... You know, there's there's no, the character that you do your life in much like it doesn't mean that that per, that character does that is not going to be there for for mm-hmm. just not a long time hey i'm I'm gonna tell you guys a secret uh you you guys are lucky that you didn't have him for more than he showed up he is a handful hey listen mr pearl been working since since he was a youngin right since he yeah, was like he's been doing it for a long time five yeah. six on broadway that dude he's been around so whenever i was around him i just kept the mouth shut my ears open okay maybe i talked a little bit because yeah know, I, but you know you just you listen to a guy like that who's been around and, and who knows if you're in that you know if you're in the field if you're an actor entertainer he's done it he's done all of it and one of the biggest movies ever, you know. So, uh, yeah, fantastic. He he taught me a lot, uh, both indirectly and directly. So it was a privilege, definitely. That's awesome. 
That's awesome. Shout out, Mr. Pearl. Yes. Right. Hopefully yes. we get him on the future. Yes. Yes. So what he we've done, you know, in, in, in not, you know, just you know, Master Island, big surprise. You no, know, he's he's a actually really known character. Yeah, and he's still doing yeah. stuff to this day, I think. Tinker I got a great picture of me on the last show uh of the in the UK of, oh my of big surprise. Um, I came out dressed as Tinker Putt Jr. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. Oh, my. yeah, I got a picture of that. I'm I'm dressed just like Barry, uh, except I don't have any gray in my hair. I had curly <laughs> hair too. They Thank curled you. it all out so that everybody could go out. Ain't no more dogs. <laughs> yeah. It's just fun to talk for dogs, you know. <laughs> Yeah, no, yeah. T- Tinkerfoot truly was. He was a funny. He was a funny character. Mm-hmm. Yeah, <laughs> he was never- played by someone, and you know, like we, you know, mentioned, he's he was played by someone who's done acting and stuff for many, many years. Mm-hmm. My name is Professor Tinkerfoot. <laughs> <laughs> yes, this song I, I, is really I, good. I remember, I, remember the, I remember that one song of the Mashish and Big Surprise as well, where we we. Touch or something that's or something. Yeah, we know. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. It's me, all love of toys. Yeah. Uh, yes. Make them yeah. all by myself. And we know. Listen to the nighttime was a big surprise, but it What's got new out. inventions. Oh gosh. It's awesome. Mm-hmm. So awesome. Well, guys, you got any more questions for me? I think Jakey does. Anyway. Jakey has a lot of them. Um. Before we do wrap up, Jakey, I do want to mention one thing, but but go ahead and do your question. I'll do it at the very end. So All right. this is what I'm gonna do. All right. Um, so do, do you want if if you if you want to, you know, you know, of course, not just you know, green screen can back back background can be like a little whatever. Is there anything you want to show us that that was basically pictures or something that you want that, that you having that or do that, you have that they, they you? work with that that you did? For, for that you, kept you know what? I don't have anything on me right now. I don't have. Uh, I you know what I do have though. You oh, might. What? This is this is odd. What is it? Wait a sec. Wait. Uh, Can you see it? it? No. No, it's yeah. something great. It, it's a little, it's a little like, like yeah. Oh, oh, wait. oh, Bob oh, the Bill. Oh, Bob the Bill. Oh my god! Oh, oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Is that like yeah. awesome? Is that like a blanket or a hoodie or a jacket? Yeah, that's, that's my bus blanket. Have. My bus blanket. Oh, wow. wow, that's awesome. That's that's cool. Let's go cool. right. well, well, of course, probably, uh, me and Chris having up uh, those. Yeah, Chris actually has the better game called. Well, of course you do. Yeah. Oh yeah, I, I know. I know that. I know that Michael, like Brian Epps, who was Michael, ha, has the um has the walk with Barney doll, which I know you have yeah. it as well, um, Chris. Yes, I do. And I also have this a giant thing. Yes. Giant Barney. Yeah, yeah I, I kind of like that, but it's a little up, more updated. But one. Yeah, but Chris I, actually I, has I, that. I, I, also, I have the same. I That's the, the one same. Bob West has. Yeah, Bob yeah. Has same, done exact, that. same exact. Same yes, he's that done. Bob he's West. done uh, cameos with that Barney before. I think he yeah. still does. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he did. Yeah, I have this for BJ and Beer Bob too, and of course some DDs with me. That's yeah, Patty works. No, I just I just have a bunch of VHS tapes. So I, have so I do too. I got, got the collection nice. Hey guys, I hate to I hate to cut it short, but uh, I've got time for one more question. If you guys, all right, one. there's. All right. Um, I'm gonna all say right. my thing right now. Yeah. So to sure. the viewers of this video, this this it on the filming of this t- tomorrow will be my birthday. You can yep. wish me birthday in the comments. Yeah. It, even though it'll be it, late because this won't be going out tomorrow. But mm-hmm. yeah, yeah, but, yeah, yeah, Happy yeah, birthday. yeah. Just yeah, take, there you go, Matthew. Yeah, people you know, watching, you know, whatever, you know. It's, it's good for you. There you go, Matthew. You got your first co-host. birthday shout out. Matthew, you you shout out in the comments or around yes. the, the, the podcast yeah. social media. But anyways, awesome. last thing I want to give is: Do you want to have? Do you want to give your social media to you know for con for? Yeah, like where can people for, find you and stuff? Everywhere. <laughs> there you go. There you well, go. It's in the comment. It's, it's in the description down below. But anyways, yeah, um, check me out. And, original and, Boo on Twitter. Uh, Josh Martin Voice. No, that's opposite. Josh Martin voice on Twitter. Instagram is original boo. 
Josh Martin everywhere else, you know, look for me, sweetgreenhands.com, my uh, mashup tribute band. Mm-hmm. And um, rhyming and stealing got, dot com, the Beastie Boys, the original Beastie Boys tribute band. Mm-hmm. Dragon Ball Z, you know, everything where yeah. you balls with balls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And uh, and real quick, because I know we got our wrap up. Do you have any uh, for anyone who wants to get into like acting? Do you have like any like quick yeah, advice right. for anyone who wants to get into it? Yes. Don't. It's Thank lame. <laughs> <laughs> Taking that's another route. Yeah, 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 yeah that's not much for that for sure. Do something else. Do something yeah. else. Get a real yeah, job. Yeah, yeah. Do that's else. the best way, way you want to do for your that's a career. Less for your competition life, but... for me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Anyways, don't you yeah. Hey, dude, seriously, seriously, though, if that's what you want to do, you do it. Uh, whatever you want to do, you do it. Uh, acting specifically, educate yourself. You can do that very many, many ways these days besides uh, school um, online. You can do workshops. Uh, online workshops are great these days, especially COVID made it necessary to do online. Um, you know, go for it. Mm-hmm. Go for it. Do it. You miss 100% of the opportunities you don't take. Yep. Anyways, 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 Josh, you're 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 a fun and great person. Yeah. Be, that's be, yes, that's it has been an honor you. having you as a second guest. Yeah, yeah you're, you're a great person. You, you're, 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 you're a fun. You're a fun you Thank you so much for it's having me here, Josh. Up. And who knows? Hope, and who knows? Hopefully, maybe one day we can have you back. Maybe even yes, with Carrie or somebody. Maybe, no, wait, 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 no, Anyways, thank you so much for, for having here, yeah, Josh, and so Smaller, and see what what's what's I'm um, can't wait for what's happening for you for your for, for your you in general for your future and see more projects wherever somehow you're gonna yeah. be involved in the future or even more more involved with purple with purple roads. Who knows? Mm-hmm. With, thank you, you know, Alex. And Allison. I know you're working so much with with Carrie with, with purple roads recently. Yeah, so but you can't that's work. good. You know, Carrie, that's purple roads is amazing. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching this second episode. Hope you all enjoy. Um for if you guys have any thoughts about this for more support for more you know for more episodes you know and of course the, the support that the has for, for for this episode you comment down below like subscribe more episodes you know as always you know every youtuber say and be sure well, to like our uh, our page on facebook and twitter and instagram and and, and as well as spotify and, and, and mixed spot, so you can uh, listen to us well for the first two episodes you know right boost lane yes. and and and, that's and now Josh course. Martin, which, uh, yeah. Yep. Yep. Anyways, off. like and subscribe. And yep. off. Yes, and subscribe anyways, to our YouTube channel, yes. Uh, anyways, anyways, thank you, I mean, I mean, uh, thank you so much for watching come. with us. Before we go, I think he should sing I Love You with Bowie. Yes! Yes! yes. 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 What's the request? Sing I Love You in the Barney Boys. <laughs> for everybody out there. Only if you sing it with me. Ready? Oh, okay. Okay. okay yes. Do it. Do it. We'll see you at the end. You, you, you love, love me. me. You are happy. happy family with a great big hug. Hug. It's from me to me you. you. Won't you, you say you love me to you? It probably sounds oh. really out of sync. And of course, remember, uh, I love but, you. For those two old fellas too, and we're as well. <laughs> but anyways, know, thank you, awesome. anyways, thank you so much for miss for great for for watching this, and great we're having for more. Anyways, thank, anyways, hope you joy and see you see you all for more for next video from us right. to co- for co-host and me and Josh. Of course, Barney loves you no matter what you are, mm-hmm. and see you on in the next. See you on next. See you on for the next episode. Anyways. Bye, everyone. Anyways, bye. As, as always, but bye for now and see you later. See you on you as well. Bye-bye. See you next time for another episode of Jake's Happiness Thoughts Show. See you again soon. Bye-bye.